I love arts and crafts. I love jewelry making. I love the whole thing. There's some interesting um, uh, things you can use to make jewelry. Well, I think Liz will get into this because Liz likes necklaces and you have the nice fancy earrings. earrings and yeah. stuff like that. Oh, where's the bling? All the time. <laughs> All the time she wears the bling. So here's the thing. There is a very unique um, type of necklace this woman makes. Oh, I'm interested. I'm she, all in. I think a lot of people would be interested in this, honestly. Uh, something happened, though, when she was coming back into the country. I don't know where she was coming from, but she came back into the country through uh, Minneapolis, St. Paul. Mm. And at customs, where she was stopped to re enter into the country, they said, um, Ma'am, you can't bring this in. What was she? Maybe, was it sharp? Like something she was putting safety really. pins or something. She had well, there was one little shell that was in there. It looked like you know a snail shell I've brought that back was shells in there. Before. And then some things that looked like um, meatballs. Well, you can't bring if she was overseas. You can't bring food in like that. Like well, what, it food. wasn't food. The food was already processed, digested, and then um, went through a giraffe. And so it was giraffe droppings that were in this box. She was going to make a necklace out of it. That's She's what she does. Earrings out of Necklace. Neck necklace, yeah. Well, she right might make some earrings. Nose? Why? Well, I don't know if you want to put that under your nose, but she well, does. That's where a necklace goes. <laughs>